Win as one. EA Sports FIFA 21. Sponsors Saturday Social. This is FIFA Versus with Nelson Semedo in partnership with EA Sports FIFA 21. Nelson, I'm going to be quizzing you on your Wolves teammates FIFA 21 ratings. Before we get into it, do you know what rating you are on FIFA 21? I guess 82, 82, 81. It's actually 83. It's actually 83. 83. You've gone up since last year. Are you happy with oh, that? Oh, nice. Nice, nice, nice. It's nice, yeah. And obviously, your best attribute is your pace. Is there any other attributes you would like to improve? You've only got 57 shooting. Maybe that should be a bit higher. Oh my God, but that, that's not correct, my friend. Okay, like, <laughs> what is this? Do you remember your first ever FIFA card? I don't remember. It's like when I had uh, braids, I guess. Yeah, it was. 67? Is that? 72, actually. 72, oh, so 72. you're a little bit better. Oh, it's nice. Yeah, nice, yeah. Fika. But you've yeah, come up yeah. 11 since then, so lots of improvement. Yeah, it's nice, it's nice, it's nice. <laughs> yeah, let's keep going. And let's start with your first question on your teammates. Who do you think is the highest rated player at Wolves, according to FIFA 21? Uh, maybe Raul. Yeah, it is. Raul Jimenez, 84, as well as Rui Patricio at 84. Yeah, I have to say, you're 83. Um, so do you think that's about right? Yes, yes, it's correct. Yeah, it's fair. Yeah. And obviously, we've seen Raul back on the back in and around Wolves, back on the training ground occasionally. How's he getting on? It's getting better. It's getting better. He started training with the group uh, and we hope he can be with us in a, in a pitch to, to help us again. Yeah, it's great to see. And obviously, Rui Patricio as well, the other player up there with 84 rating. What's it like having such an experienced goalkeeper behind you as a defender? Well, we feel we feel secure, we feel comfortable. We try not to give him some a lot of work, but when he has it, he, he shows his his potential. He shows that that is a is a very good goalkeeper. Nice. Okay, let's do the next one. Who do you think has the highest strength on the Wolves team? Adama. Adama it's actually have, not have, Adama. If okay, then you you have you have to you have to to correct it because <laughs> it's him. According to FIFA 21, I tell you, it's actually Willy Bolly. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, Willy Bolly. Yeah, Willy Bolly. Yeah, it's fair. Yeah, yeah. Well, Willy Bolly is actually the strongest player in the entire Premier League, according to FIFA 21. Yeah. You said a Dharma <laughs> Traore there. If those two were to have a wrestling match, who do you think would win, a Dharma oh, or Willy? I don't know. I don't know, man. It's, it's difficult. It's difficult to bet in one because Bolly is very tall and very, very tall and very strong. Adama is, is it's like uh, a bit, a bit smaller, but he's is very strong as well. So I don't know it. Which one I, I will bet. It brings us quite nicely onto our next question, actually. Uh, who do you think has the best acceleration in the squad? Best acceleration, Adama, of course. Yeah, of course, it is Adama. 97 nah. acceleration. And he's just rapid, isn't he? You obviously train against him every day. How do you stop him in training? Uh, like I said, you don't. <laughs> you don't, but because <laughs> if you start running, if you start running and you, and you try to stop him, it does just like this, and you go to the you go to the floor, my friend. <laughs> so you you better just running running back and 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 wait him to pass the ball or to go to another direction. <laughs> and I also wanted to ask. I see him pre-match sometimes oiling up his arms. Is he putting oil on his arms to stop people grabbing him? Yes, uh, that's a that's a thing he does because the guys try to stop him, like uh, uh, grabbing him and. Like mm. that, they can do it. Okay, nice. Let's move on to the next question then. A little head-to-head -head here between a couple of Portuguese wonder kids. Who has the better dribbling, Pedro Neto or Fabio Silva? Uh, Pedro Neto. Yeah, it is Pedro Neto, Pedro Neto. Just he has seventy-seven. Fabio Silva has seventy-two. Are you surprised at how low Pedro Neto's dribbling is? Do you think it should be a bit higher? Yes, I, I guess would be uh, should be higher because he's he's very good dribbling. You know. He already show us uh, his, poten his potential, but uh, dribbling is, is very good. So I guess it should be higher, yeah. And it must be a really exciting time to be in and around the Port uh, Portuguese national team as well, because you've got so many young, exciting players yeah. and some really experienced professionals too. What's it like being in and around that Portuguese setup? 
Well, it's nice. It's very nice because we have a mix of uh, of youngest players and uh, and uh, old players that help. Uh, well, we help each other. You know, we help each other a lot, and it's very nice. We have so much quality in the team. And you've obviously played with a lot of exciting young players throughout your career, you know, at Barcelona, now at Wolves, at Benfica. How good do you think Pedro Neto can become? Well, I'm not putting limits. I'm not going to put limits, but he can be he can be a top player, like top, top, top player. OK, let's do the next one. Who has the best long shot stats in the Wolves team? Mm. Of Ruben, Ruben Neves. It is Ruben Neves. Are there any other players you think should be up there alongside him? In our team, maybe Neto shoots very well as well, and uh, Moutinho. Yeah, we saw Moutinho score that amazing goal as well against Arsenal, didn't we? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's very good shooting. And what's it like playing with Ruben Neves? From the outside, he seems so talented, and he's still so young, but he's experienced so much. Well, it's a player who starts playing in in a first team and in Porto and with I guess 17 he was already captain yeah. I guess he can he can be a very a top player as well because he have so so much to to like to improve so much potential and he are so good now with his age so he have the best uh, the best years of his career coming and he can he can be like a very good player Let's do the final question. We know Adama is obviously the fastest player on the team. We've spoken about that. But who do you think is the slowest according to FIFA 21? <laughs> the slowest? Ooh. Yeah, I would say Connor. Yeah, Connor yeah he is. Is he? Correct. Is he? he only has, How much he has? He, only, <laughs> he has 47. Bye, but it's, it's not 47. Come on, guy. He's <laughs> <laughs> not a, a 47. What's it like playing with Connor uh, in defence? Because he seems like such a leader back there. Honestly, when I, when I arrived, I thought he was he was older because of his leadership. Because he's a very good leader and um, a very good captain for us, and a very ex experienced uh, player as well with very good qualities. And he's he's very good to play with him. And he is obviously part of what is a very solid backline, but everybody seems to speak Portuguese back there. Does he communicate with you guys in Portuguese or in English or? Well, he try. We communicate more in English, but he try to do. He try to say some some words in in, uh, in Portuguese. Yeah, he tried to say some words in Portuguese. Yeah, brilliant. Okay, fantastic. It's been great catching up with you this afternoon, Nelson. Okay, Joe. It was nice. It was nice to talk with you as well. That was FIFA versus with Nelson Semedo in partnership with EA Sports FIFA 21.